Okay, I'm going to make a short tutorial here how to get Vorpex working in Star Citizen under cinema mode. People have asked for it, so here we go. First thing you do is you open the launcher, get the launcher ready to go. After the launcher is ready to go, double click Vorpex. It is a $40 program, works in just about every game. Most of the times you do not have to run it in cinema mode where you can pretty much get true 3D. Trouble is that Embryard or CIG has got it set up. You can't hook into the game. Works great in all the crisis games. Just doesn't work under here. After you start it, Vorpex, right click it and pause the watcher. After you pause the watcher, go ahead and load into the game. Wait for your menus to come up. One thing you want to make sure once you open the game, get in the menus, make sure you're in window mode. Resolution doesn't make any difference, but if you are in full screen, it will crash the game. Once again, for some reason, this game engine or the programming in it from CIG does not like being hooked. So make sure you're in window mode. Once your once your menu's up, once again, go to your Vortex panel, hit resume watcher. After you've done that, go back in the panel again and start Vorpex Desktop Viewer. Now that you've done all that, it's time to get into your Vive or your Rift, what I'm using, and your screen will be live. After you do that, to set all the settings you need, you need to hit the delete key and you will come up with main settings. You want cinema mode on, scene is your background around. I don't, I know you can't see it, but uh, it's up. Pick your image, lock head tracking, you want to make sure is off. Screen distance, you want to go, you want to adjust it to it pretty much looking straight ahead. All you can see is the Star Citizen menu screen. Aspect radio, let it go auto. Screen curvature, I have it maxed at two. Screen curve vertical on. Go to your next settings, which will be any image setting, content type normal, stereo type mono. If you try to side by side, it just doesn't work. Crystal image, how clear it is. I put it on aggressive. Uh, nothing else you actually have to change. It's just personal preferences. Go to display, display settings, window mirror you have to turn off. It will crash the game if you try to mirror it. I've been working on it, haven't got it to work yet. Async on, flight sync on, GPU sync. I have not found it made any difference no matter what I set it on. You don't need edge peak. But you can leave it on or off doesn't matter head tracking on head tracking sensitivity run it up to five which is the max head roll on you do not need to invert the axis that is pretty much only things we have to change once you do that click ok and save Okay, now after you've done that, hit Alt plus spacebar looking directly ahead 
and click alt space bar that will center your head tracking now you're ready to go in anything you want to do whether it's universe arena commander doesn't make any difference you can just start it go through your menus vandal swarm you can go into pu doesn't make any difference pick your ship and launch game and as you can see head tracking works piece of cake vandal swarm